In this module, we spent a lot of time on looking at core cultivation and top dressing as a means of controlling soil compaction and also organic matter. And I'm standing out here, it's actually late winter here at Ohio State Golf Course on uh, one of the fairways. And you can notice, or I'll at least show it to you uh, here in a minute, is all these clumps of soil or dirt that have emerged. These are earthworm cats. Uh, throughout this course where earthworms are actually feeding and recycling on the organic matter and working their ways through the soil. So a natural way of controlling organic matter or, or thatch uh, here in turf situations is the act of or activity of earthworms. And so uh, kind of a natural control of, of again organic matter. Earthworms uh, uh, at this time, obviously, are, are not a problem because nobody's out here playing golf. But there have been golf courses that I've seen in Europe, for example, or in Scotland and England, where the earthworm castings get so uh, numerous or so bad that literally you can't play golf because the ground's so disruptive and everything. So that's one disadvantage, almost similar to uh, Corey, uh that we do, is that a lot of golfers don't like the disruption of the surface. That also happens with uh, earthworms. But to get that thatch controlled and recycled, disruption needs to occur. So as uh, I'll be showing you some close-ups and some pictures of these earthworm castings. But again, earthworms are a natural way on golf courses that help control organic 